everybody, and welcome to Just Fix It, where I fix the problem with no fluff or extra intro, excluding this one, of course. So, let's get right into it. Um, this video has three main parts, and the timestamps for each part are below. So, if you just want to skip this part, you know, skip to what you're most interested or what you want, and my skip my grading voice, I completely understand, I would do the same thing. So first, the three parts, uh, first is a rundown of what the problem was for me, and this is so you guys can determine if this video is for you, or if you should go elsewhere, find another type of video. Not everything I say will probably solve your problem, but hopefully it will. The second part is how I fix the issue, and the last part are, you know, other ways to fix it if it doesn't work for you. I found some pretty good other ways from a website, which the link for that is also down below. But let's just get right into it with the rundown of what the problem was for me, so you know if this is for you. Uh, so I had a problem that came on pretty suddenly. YouTube would suddenly crash every time I tried to play YouTube videos on Chrome. So every time I tried to open a video, or in the middle of a video, it would freeze, with the audio still playing in the background. But my computer would eventually tell me that it wasn't responding, and I would eventually have to close it. So I would close Chrome and try to open again, only to get a white screen of death. I couldn't even get to normal Google search, couldn't, I couldn't do anything. So I would have to restart my computer in order to even open Chrome again. However, all the other websites like Facebook, Twitter, and normal Google search did work fine after I restarted my computer. But if I tried anything with YouTube again, it would just not agree with me, completely shut down. So just to get right into how I fixed the problem, if you look on the screen, I have the uh, link for an Adobe Flash Player download. It appears that it appeared that my Adobe Flash Player plugin didn't exist on my uh, computer, and it just I couldn't even find it in the control panel. Or maybe yours isn't updated. That could be your problem as well. But I have the link for this download uh, below. All you have to do is really update or download the latest version of Adobe Flash Player. So once again, the link is below. You click Install Now. Um, you know, it installs it. You don't really need to go through the whole process. You just need to follow the steps um, listed below. Clicking the Flash plugin, install, etc. You guys get the idea. But just to make sure it worked, make sure you go to your Chrome plugins. And you can follow this link um, that I have listed on the screen, also in the description below. But make sure that Adobe Flash Player is checked as always allowed to run. And this will hopefully fix your problem as it fixed the problem for me. But if this does not work for you, I do have four other ways to fix the problem that I found um, from a website, but it is the same website that fixed the problem, so I'm pretty sure that these ways are reliable, or they're possibly reliable. Um, the first and the most common was to either, you know, restart your computer or reinstall Chrome completely. Uh, I did those both, and they did not work. I'm pretty sure you guys know how to restart your computer, but if you don't know how to uninstall something from your control panel, uh, you can type in control panel here, uh, go to uninstall a program, you can type in Chrome, you should find it, oh, I can't spell, wonderful, right here, there's Chrome, you double click it, it'll ask you to uninstall it, and you uninstall it, pretty straightforward, uh, I wouldn't suggest it, it didn't work for me, but if trying anything will work, go ahead and do it. Um, another common fix suggested on multiple websites, not just the one I found, was to clear your cache, cookies, and browser history. So in order to do that, you go to settings, you go to history, click on history, and you see the clear browsing data right here. And you, you go and you go to the beginning of time. You want to delete everything. Browsing history, download history, cookies, uh, cached images and files. Just clear everything out close it again, maybe restart your computer, but I think just clearing it should do the job, and see if that works. Um, then third, and the third suggestion is if you had adblock, this may cause an issue. So uninstalling adblock from your computer, you should go to your settings. Once again, we're already in settings, but you click the extensions portion, and if you have adblock, look for it here, and if it's here, you click the trash can and you get rid of it, and then try it again. See if that works. See if getting rid of adblock will work for you. Um, the final suggestion is a little out of my reach in terms of knowledge on the subject, but it says to switch off your hardware accelerator. And apparently this is great for video games. Hardware accelerators are great for video games, but it might create some compatibility problems with YouTube. 
so you should disable your hardware video acceleration settings and then try again. Um, I'm not experienced with that, but I left a link below that does a pretty good job explaining on how to do so, how to disable or reduce your hardware acceleration in Windows um, 7 and 8. I'm not sure if it works for 10, but you guys can give it a try if none of these other solutions are working for you. So there you guys have it. Those were my solutions to the YouTube crashing Chrome problem, whatever you'd like to call it. Uh, the Adobe Flash Player problem, I'd like to call it. Uh, let me know if my solution helped you guys out, or if you guys have another suggestion on how to fix it, please feel free to leave it in the comments below. This video is here for you guys, and to help uh, hopefully avoid the stress that I had when I was trying to fix this issue. Also, I have the sources for everything that I mentioned in the video. They are all, once again, in the description below. So you guys can feel free to sift through all those websites that I have, you know, listed below. And hopefully, if, if my problems, if my uh, solutions didn't help you fix the problems, hopefully these links might lead you to somewhere else or might help you figure out the problem on your own. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. Uh, please give it a thumbs up if, if this helped you at all, if this helped you fix the problem. I would really appreciate it. And I hope to just fix things for you guys in the future.